We are live outside the Sheridan Center on Queen Street where talks between QP, school boards and the provincial governments have broken off, which means that the union representing 55,000 Ontario education workers will begin a work to rule campaign starting tomorrow. We have a statement from the education minister which we just received. He says he is deeply disappointed that QP has decided to end talks this weekend and proceed with a partial withdrawal of services despite a limited number of outstanding items at the table. Now this was the second day of talks. Uh, they restarted yesterday and today marks the final effort to stave off a work to rule campaign. What this will mean is that clerical staff have been told not to supervise children, update the school's websites or social media feeds. Education assistants will not uh, allow classes to proceed. Custodians will not pick up garbage outside or clean ministry unfunded areas including hallways, offices and gyms among the list of other things. Now QP is just one of several unions locked in talks that was locked in talks with the province so far. None of them have reached a deal and the talks come as a result of the government ordering school boards to increase class sizes, which will mean almost 4,000 fewer teachers in the system over four years.